<laughs> Don't smile. <laughs> Hi. Hi! Welcome back to our channel. Thank you guys so much for tuning back in. Today's tutorial will be consisting of a Mortal Kombat inspired look. I will be turning myself into Melena or Melina, however you say it, and... Katana! Kaya will be Katana. So if you guys want to see how we created these looks, definitely keep on watching. <laughs> Alright, jumping right in. We're going to be using the Pores No More primer from Dr. Bryant and I'm going to put this all over my face. I'm going to take a white pencil. You can use any pencil that you'd like and I'm just going to roughly mark out where I want the mouth to be. I'm going to go in with Makeup Forever Ultra HD Foundation and I'm going to sponge this all over my face, avoiding the mouth area, of course. I'm going to go in with this dark foundation stick from Hot Makeup and just contour my entire face. So I'm going to use Colourpop's eyeshadow in IOU and I'm going to place this on my crease with a fluffy brush. I'm going to use this as my transition color for the rest of the eyeshadows that I'm going to be using. And then just make sure that you blend all the way through and down towards the nose as well. I'm going to be going in with Get Out in Cute Alert from Colourpop and I'm going to do the exact same thing. Just placing those two colors on the crease and blending everything outward and upward. I'm going to go in with a Sugar Pills eyeshadow in Bulletproof. I'm going to pack that on the outer corner, concentrating that color right at the V of your eye and then just blending it all out. We're going to take the color, take it slow from Colourpop and place that all over the lid in a packing motion. Next I'm going to take a liquid liner. I believe this one is from Sally's. I'm just going to make a thin but also very extravagant liner and I'm going to connect it to the bottom as well. We're going to go in with the same colors that we use for our eyes and start contouring our face. I'm going to chisel out my cheekbones, my forehead, under my lip and then my nose as well. So next we're going to take Epix Cosplay Paint in white. We're going to start placing down the base for each individual tooth. So I'm going to go ahead and go back into the ColourPop shadow and create a little bit of depth. I'm going to be going from the lightest to the darkest and I'm just going to roughly blend all of the teeth upward. So next we're going to take the Epix Cosplay paint in black and we're just going to start creating upside down teardrops on every single tooth. Now that we have all of the teeth outlined, we're going to go ahead and fill in all of the gaps with black face paint. Also be very careful not to get it in your teeth like I did, but it's okay, we'll fix it. Once we're done with that, we're going to go ahead and go into Bulletproof again and just drag out some of the black in between each two. So 
So this next step is optional. You don't have to do this part, but I wanted to add a little bit of texture to the mouth area. So I took a liquid liner and I started to do a stippling effect around the teeth itself. We're going to go in Sugar Pills Poison Plum Eyeshadow. And I'm just going to lightly start placing this randomly all over the face, around the mouth, where my eyebrows are, just to give it a little bit more color. And that pretty much concludes my part of the tutorial. I hope you guys enjoyed. Hi, I'm back. I'm using kimchi on my eyes. And that pretty much concludes our tutorial. Thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel as well as follow us on Instagram. We will link all of the description details down below. And we'll see you next time. We love you. Ciao.